Hello, I'm Greg Redman. I'm a healthcare IT advisor here with the Kentucky Regional Extension Center. I work on the security risk assessment team. And as a part of that, we provide a service known as a vulnerability scan. In doing this, uh, vulnerability scan's whole goal is to actually scan your local network to find out what devices have missing patches, open ports, and or open configurations. Uh, the whole process takes anywhere between 15 minutes to up to an hour, depending on how big your network is. We can actually scan up to three subnets. Your IT department will know what I speak of. Um, and we scan for individual devices, literally everything on your network, from your servers, to your laptops, to your workstations, to the wireless access points that you get on with your Wi-Fi devices, to your camera systems, to your phone systems. Everything is included in it. At the end of this scan, we will generate a report. This report covers and enumerates vulnerabilities by severity, infrastructure or devices by severity, giving you both a percentage and an actual physical number for those vulnerabilities and defective infrastructure. It also lists and enumerates the most common vulnerabilities, um, such as outdated certificates for web servers, which is, and other devices, which is very common, um, secure socket layer SSL vulnerabilities, um, and uh, SIFs and or open shares or shares that need attention, things that we all take for granted when we connect to a system. It will also categorize these vulnerabilities and then ranks the highest vulnerabilities. Um, this is probably the most important as it provides, this ranking provides an overview into a list of the most vulnerable systems that need addressed based on priority. It uses a CVSS score to rank the associated devices based on what the scanner has found. In essence, the, the report and the scan itself generates a report that you can actually start to plan and manage the remediation of your network risk. This will lower your exposure and provide insight into things that need attention on your network. If you actually would like or are interested in this network scan, please come see me at the conference or email me at greg.redman at uky.edu. And I'll be happy to, to address any concerns you have or explain further what the network vulnerability scan entails and what you can expect to get from it. If you have any questions, uh, you can 